I'm Jen, and this is my studio space. I'm an artist based in Dallas, and I work in porcelain and weaving. So I weave different materials together, and I weave the porcelain into it. So all of these, I call them tiny monsters, are movable and mobile and can be rearranged. I've also experimented with some stop motion animation, which I really enjoy. All of my work is inspired by nature. Last year I took a research trip to the Alaskan coast and explored the tide pools during a supermoon. Many of these tiny monsters are created as a direct inspiration from that trip. Being out in nature is really important to me. Some pieces are actually created to live outside. I enjoy installing works in trees and creating works that interact with beneficial insects. One project that really took off is the bee cups. Bee cups collect a little bit of water for thirsty bees and butterflies. So I developed the bee cups to help pollinators get water um, and keep water in the environment. And I also wanted to make these look a little bit more like flowers to the bees. So I developed a glaze that glows under black light and under a UV light. So the bees can see UV color even though humans can't. This means that these flowers are gonna look more like, I mean, sorry, these bee cups are gonna look more like flowers to bees and to other pollinators, even when they're dry and don't have water in them. I enjoy doing large installations of bee cups. This oasis at the Houston Botanic Garden had over 3,000 bee cups. I sell the bee cups for my studio in Dallas and it's become a thriving business. This year, I'm excited to add more fibers into my studio work. I bought a loom and I'm taking some basketry classes to learn more about different techniques for making monsters. Thank you for taking the time to learn about my art and a little bit more about what I do as an ecological artist. I hope you'll follow me on social media. Thanks.